They love you. I thought you were going to pull off something unbelievable on grand final day. You went forward, you were nearly the match winner. A couple of the best goals you're ever likely to see. Couldn't quite get it done. Um, how will it be for the boys heading into 2018, surely driving them on this year? Yeah, definitely. I think we had a really special season at the Magpies. I think um, a lot of the boys knew it was going to be hard to get into the AFL team with all the in with no injuries pretty much and um, sort of didn't come back with bad attitudes at all. And um, full credit to them and even the contractor boys and the Maggies to go back and to the resis and do what they did is just a massive credit to them and just the environment we had there led by Chad was just unbelievable and to get so close to the grand final and winning it was uh, heartbreaking but I'm sure it'll drive the boys for next year. Yeah, I wanted to ask you about that, the, the bond and the, the group seems united from right from the top from the best player through to you know the 44th player on the list and, and credit to yourself and Lowe's we heard how well he spoke later but the culture at the footy club just seems so strong at the moment. Yeah, that's the one thing that's the best. Like, it's the best thing about the club, really. Like, you go in and you just have 43 mates, and it's just we're so close. And the big thing we talk about all year is just being united and sticking together. And there's always going to be external stuff that tries to, you know, fracture the team. But um, we just stayed strong and just stuck with each other all year. And not what we wanted, but still a pretty successful year, really. So we've uh, laid down the foundation for something pretty special. And for you two, uh, second in the McGarry medal, now uh, a Port Adelaide best and fairest. You'll go down in the history books, this famous club winning at BNF. I'm sure there's so many people you'd love to thank. Yeah, thanks, Kane. Um, yeah, I suppose I'll just start off with uh, Chad, your big strong thing. Thanks for uh, all the faith and, and the respect you paid me this year and your, and your coaching staff as well. It's just made it such an enjoyable year for me, to be honest, and I just love playing, love playing for the Maggies. Um, Three special mentions I'd like just to say real quick. Um, firstly, to David Stevenson, um, my mindset coach for this year. It was um, pretty tough times in pre-season trying to deal with the fact I knew I wouldn't play many AFL games, but you uh, helped me find the motivation and drive to commit all my energy to the SANFL and um, ended up being the most enjoyable year I've played footy all my life, pretty much. Um, to Paulie Vandenberg and, and Emma, just the stuff you've done for me over the last six years and, um, you know, the the things you do for my family and just making sure that me and the rest of the Aboriginal boys are just happy. It's just, it does, like, the stuff you do is unreal. Like, you're just a legend, mate. Love you. Um, and to Stewie Cochran as well, mate. You, um, you've probably been the one bloke since I got here that's done everything in your power to, you know, make me the best player I can be. And I'll always appreciate that wherever I go. Um, to my girlfriend, Cassie. You've been with me since the start. Um, a lot of tough times that we got through, but... Uh, I think you know more than anyone how much this award means to me. So um, thanks for that, for all your support. And lastly, just to my family, uh, mum and dad, for they moved over to Adelaide just to watch me play footy this year. They wanted to see me win a premiership and I got close, but um, having their support, raising six boys, we all played footy. It's pretty tough for mum and dad, but they, they did it. And um, yeah, it was awesome just having their support. And uh, sorry, just to the... Yeah, thank you. And lastly, just to the boys... Um, like footy, it's just a sport, but really like what you take out of it at the end of the day is all the memories and friendships you make along the way. And like I said before, 43, 44 blokes, I love you all. And um, I just want to thank you for the memories and everything we've done for the past six years. And I uh, look forward to sharing a beer with you tonight. Thank you.